All right, guys, welcome. Um, doing another Daisy tutorial. This time, I'm in the Daisy editor. Now, um, this is a program that you'd use to, like, you know, create custom areas, post objects down on your server, uh, well, post objects down to import them into your server. Now, I'm not going to show you how to do that, but what I'm going to show you do, what I'm going to show you is like the reverse, how you can remove certain objects. Uh, that's currently in your server as default that like Daisy as placed um, So what you're gonna need is obviously on your server you're gonna need to install the Daisy uh, editor mod and the Daisy editor loader mod um, Now if I quickly open up my steam and just bring steam across so this is the Daisy editor loader mod you want this and the other one's just Daisy editor um, so make sure you have both of these installed on your server. There is another step with this mod that you're going to need to do, but I will show you that in a sec. Uh, but first of all, let's go back to the uh, Daisy editor. Now, what you want to do is say I'm currently at Altar. Now, say I didn't want this radio station. Um, I wanted this like area completely empty. So I had like a, a pretty much a blank canvas to, you know, re put something else there uh, what I could do is go up to it old control middle mouse button is gone same for the items inside same for these cars uh, we should be able to do the same for the trees oh, I currently pick something up um, you can also you know move them if you want to uh, holding control and left click and you can you can move stuff, uh, but let's just delete them. Uh, let's just delete these. Say we didn't want these. Okay. Um, same for that. There are some things that you can't remove, uh, like you know the main ground, uh, the grass. You can delete the bushes and rocks you just can't delete like the main like surface of the map you can't also delete roads um, there is something work in progress as far as I'm still aware of they did want to remove the roads but you can delete vehicles like this you can delete pretty much I would say 98% of stuff um, why can't I delete that okay for some reason I can't seem to delete that but I would have thought I sh should be able to okay I'm just deleting the trees in the background okay I can't delete that netting either but you get the idea so look at it control make sure you got your little mouse cursor and you can delete it now say I was happy with that and again this is um, example for video purpose only I'm not this is and this is on a test server this isn't gonna be on my main server, I'm going to put this on a test server so you can see, so everything's a test. But I wouldn't be happy with that, you know, I'd want to put objects there and stuff. But say you was happy with that, um, you can place down, let's just place down uh, another object as well. So you can see, um, like what, like a barrack or something. Um, like we can place this down. Now I'm not going to obviously, sh I'm going to show you but I'm not gonna like teach you how to like do this um, just pop that there uh, turn it around like so uh, like so uh, I mean it probably could do with going Maybe like that, okay. Uh, just click OK on that box. Um, but you can see, you know, I wouldn't be happy. I, I'd want to put more there, but that's fine. But so you can see what I did. Old control, medium mouse cursor, middle mouse button, it deletes. Now, like I said, say I was happy with that and say I just wanted that build in there. Um, but of course, for you, you put whatever buildings you want done. Um, and if you didn't even want any buildings there, say you just wanted to remove a load of stuff from part of the map because you thought it just looked ugly. Um, uh, like, I haven't really got nothing here too much. 
But maybe, you know, you've got a big tower there and you've got a little tower here. Maybe I didn't want this little tower. Um, just wanted the big tower. I could just do that. You know, and you can make the map look to look to your liking. Look, or, you know, make it look like you want it to. Then what you need to do is at the top here, uh, go file, save. Right, this will save it as a DZE files, which is going to need. Uh, scroll down, so you've got the, this file bar and where you can choose a name. Uh, we'll just call this Altar Removal. Uh, file save. Right, that'll save it. Once you're done there, you can close out of this. So, I'm going to close out of this. Um, and then... I'm going to go uh, the file saves into your documents, Daisy, if we get it, uh, into your documents, um, Daisy, and then there should be editor, so edit folder, and then you just need to find the file that you called it, and for me it's at the top here, all tile removal, and it's the .dze file. We're going to need this, so I'm just going to right click, and uh, for me I'm just going to copy... I should be able to copy. Yeah, copy. Um, I'm going to just log on to... Actually, I think I already have. Log on to my desktop. Bring that over. So, this is my server's desktop. I'm on a dedicated server. What I'm going to do is... I'm just going to right-click here and paste. So, I've just got this now file on my dedicated desktop. Now, if we... Um, open up the main screen... Now what you want to do is find wherever your server is. Uh, and for me it's going to be this test server. Now what you want to do is go to your MP missions folder and find whichever you know mission you're using. So for me it's going to be Daisy Offline Doctrinos Plus, but it'll work on DRL, Rosto, Namask, whatever you know mission you're using. Open it up and you want to create a folder called Editor Files. You can see I've already got it here. Now, with the Daisy Editor Loader mod, it should automatically create this folder. For me, it didn't. If it does it for you, great. If not, just create a new folder, call it Editor Files. And then, what you want to do is open this folder up, or you don't really need to open it up. For me, if I just move this window to one side, I can click this file that I've got, and I can just drag it into the Editor Files folder. Just like so, and if I open it up, there's the file um, but yeah that this d dot dze file what you've saved it needs to go inside these editor files folder so if your server doesn't create it for you when you install the mod just create this folder yourself and make sure it's in the mission folder uh, apart from that that is now done so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna log into this test server of mine and uh, I'll show you everything that I removed is gone and that building I added is there. So just give me two secs and I'll be in my server. Okay, so we're now just logging into my server. And we'll uh, go over to Walter and uh, I'll show you it's not there. Right. Uh, okay, so I'm... Okay, I'm currently at Green Mountain because I was doing this tutorial earlier with Green Mountain, uh, but it kind of went wrong. So, right, let's open up the map, go over to where Holtar is, just click there, and if we go, you can see the tower's not there already, but if we go to Free Cam, you can see the tower's gone, and everything else is gone uh okay this car the reason that car there is because that's an event vehicle that uh randomly spawns as an event uh but it w so that obviously wasn't there in the editor because the editor doesn't load vehicle events but you can see the all the stuff from here the little plants uh, the trees um everything that i deleted has gone um but yeah and that's what you do and if we just teleport here, and again, just in case you're thinking I may be out of distance, because sometimes if you move too far, you won't see objects. But, teleporting my character there, 
there, and you can still see, you know, the object's not there. Everything is gone as I've removed it, and the building that I've added is here. Um, obviously, I've done a video. Okay, this loot is just from the old building there. If you are deleting the buildings that contain loot, uh, you will need to go in and just like pick up the loot or delete the loot. Um, and you will need to redo the loot positions for any new buildings you place. So, I'm obviously not going to do it for this one because it's the test server. It's not a server that I really care about where loot is. But, well, <laughs> okay, I didn't delete the, uh, the door and tyres from the truck, but oh well. Um, but yeah, if you then need to get loot into the buildings, any buildings that you placed, I've obviously done a video um, on my YouTube channel uh, how to get loot working into buildings. So just go and uh, search for that. And there's also other YouTubers that's done the same thing. So uh, there's plenty of videos showing you how to get loot. But yeah, uh, you can see that's now worked. Um, if you've got any questions or anything you're not confused about, um, and like I said, I'm not going to show you how to use the A Daisy editor. Um, if you do want, have I done a video on it? I may have already done a video. If I haven't, and you do want a video how to place objects using Daisy editor, um, I can do that if you want to. But you kind of saw quickly, a quick glimpse, uh, you know, how I place that. It's, it's just the same thing. Um, but yeah, anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Hope this helps um, a lot of you. Until next time, peace out.